bath time. There's magpies having their bath. They're funny buggers. I put the water in. They all wait their turn. You know, oh, no, you're two in there. The other day, I hadn't done it for a long time, so I, um, I hadn't had a bath for a while, and I put the tray down for the first time for about a fortnight. And they all lined up, eh? There was like a, about a line of about uh, 15, or no, no, probably about 10 or something. But they all waited their turn, you know, got in two or three at a time, had their bath, hopped out, next in. <laughs> They're funny buggers. But they'll, they sometimes, after they do this, they'll go and find a bit of play, space on the lawn and they lay face down with their wings stretched out flat. You know, you think they'd been hit by a car and they'll just dead on the ground, but they just lay there and sunbake for a bit. Yeah, they love it. <laughs> Helps get the lice off them, I guess. It's tap water, so I guess it's got, you know, um, you know, things in it to keep, uh, keep the water from going stagnant, but it probably doesn't do the lice real good either. Yeah. He's going in for another dip. <laughs> As they much they love it, eh? <laughs> Can't move over, I wanna go. <laughs> yeah, bite the feathers. Come on, piss off. My turn. <laughs> yeah, here comes another. <laughs> That's the second dip that one's had. Now this one. This is why people love them. They, they like playing with toys and yeah, they make a lovely noise. They sing in the morning. Took them a while to figure out it wasn't very deep. Yeah, when I first put the tub down, I used to sort of drink out of it for a while, and then a duck or two went in it, and I went, oh, maybe it's not that deep. And they hopped in and realised, and now they they know they just all come and bath. I only just put this down five minutes ago. That and there's that that one that's in there now. It's the same one that's already had two baths. <laughs> It's the third time. Mm, the young one there, will he hop in? That light grey one there, he's a baby. Yep, here he goes. Oh, so what do I do, Mum? <laughs> oh, okay, I splash around. Oh, here he comes again. <laughs> Let's go in for a th That's the fourth one now. <laughs> they just love their bath. <laughs> it's not even food or anything, it's just water. They get in there and they swim around. I love it. I love magpies. That one there is one of the injured ones from next door. We had a bloke that poisoned over 50 magpies. Prick. Kids in, we got kids in this street and they'll come to my front door constantly asking me, could I save them, you know? And, um,. Yeah, in the end, I found out the guy across the road in that house directly across there. His name's Michael Ahern. He was baiting them with white ant spray. Evil bastard. I've got cops on him now, though, like the animal welfare and that. They're digging up all the old complaints and stuff. And I've, he started shooting them once he couldn't poison them anymore. He sat in his backyard with a slug gun that he borrowed from someone. And we're shooting them instead, and that's why we've got a heap of them now that can't go anywhere because they've got injured wings and legs and shit. And uh, yeah, so I've stopped that as well. But I got I couldn't do anything about it because we lost. I, lost, I wasn't his friend after I caught him baiting them, 
and uh, now I've got a dead bird in my freezer with a slug in its guts because he was sitting in the backyard shooting with the slug gun and one of them escaped and it died in my front yard in my gutter out the front trying to get a drink out of the stormwater pipe. Um, it had blood coming out of its mouth, you know, so obviously it was choking on its own blood. He's a friggin' evil bastard, I tell you, I hope they get him. It's a thousand dollar fine for every bird you kill, one of these magpies, they're protected. So, yeah, I hope they get the bastard. Anyway, <laughs> little darlings. Those other ibises, they just hang around the buggers, they think there's food here, but there's nothing there, I don't know, they must be getting something out of the ground. But, uh, and dirty up the bath water. Get out of it. <laughs> Hanging to get back in there for another swim. Yeah, I must love it. <laughs> Funny little buggers. <laughs> I'm surprised that they just float in it. <laughs> Back in again, there, there. Uh, <laughs> that one there is just constantly in there. Maybe he's got a bit of lice on him or something. <laughs> Little darlings. <laughs> anyway, I guess that'll do. Australian magpies, little duck, cute as. Oh, here comes another stranger for a bath. <laughs> Back in again, holy dooly. I've never seen them, well not one to swim, yeah, you know, go that many times in the same bath. <laughs> You just can't get enough of it. <laughs> Put the sprinkler on too, they um, play in the sprinkler. <laughs> Cutie. Anyway, better stop before I fill my phone up. <laughs>